in history. And your 2016 needs Hillary. So this What's is going it. on, you guys? Yeah, it's your boy D or whatever, and you know who it was when you clicked that motherfucking video. Ah! But anyway, today is a very serious matter, so I'm going to be very serious. Today's video is about voting. You guys need to go out and vote. Have a voice. Tell somebody. Snatch a bitch up. Tell them, hey, get your ass over here and vote. That's what you tell them. Vote. Your vote counts. Everybody votes counts. Mine doesn't, but yours will count. So go out and vote. When you gotta be voting? November? November 8th, I think? Go out and vote. November. Sometime. Go vote. Hello, Clinton. But make sure you go out and vote, okay? Alright, so. The reason for this video is because I received, you know, Food Network book in the mail or whatever. And I was just sitting here trying to find out what I'm gonna cook for Thanksgiving. You know? I wasn't in here talking about presidential candidate. You know, I wasn't in here for that. You know, I wasn't in here for that. But I said, you know what? I saw something in here that was very interesting. And I said, you know what? Why not? You know? Why not make a video while you bored? You know what I'm saying? You ain't got nothing to do. You ain't got no job. You ain't got shit to do. So, I said, why not? So, this was in here. It's called, it's a food fight. Okay? And it's got, you know, Hula Clinton over there. Shout out to her. 26. Seven, no, 2016 president, but 2017 is when she gonna like, you know, be in that bitch. And then Donald Trump or whatever, you know, you know, bankruptcy man, you know what I'm saying? But anyway, it say, before you cast your ballot for president, compare how the candidates eat and drink, okay? And you know, you can tell a lot about your president, about what they drink, what they dress and what all that stuff, you know? So, I will send her room. Looking at this, okay? It's Hillary Clinton versus Donald Trump, okay? I wanted to go through, let me see, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight things that they got, they're comparing each other. And we're going to see who I'm going to be voting for in the end because whatever they like, I, I'm going to have to like eventually because they're going to be the, you know, the owner of this world at the moment, you know? So, shout out to Barack. But anyway, let's get this mother started. First thing they gonna compare is caffeine boost. Okay? Now Miss Hillary Clinton, she over here supporting that tea. Mm. She say she like iced chai or otherwise type of tea. And I don't know what otherwise tea. What other tea you sipping? What kind of tea should I be sipping? She might be spilling that good tea. That might be the otherwise tea. Mm, that dirt. That's that kind of tea she be getting. Mm -hmm. And now they got Donald Trump over here with the diet sodas. Now, diet sodas ain't my thing. I don't do diet. I, only time I drink a diet soda is if I ain't got no tea. Mm. Woo! They hit my spot. But, I mean, my mama like, you know, diet soda. So, I mean, maybe she supporting Donald Trump in the moment, but... I can't do that. So, Miss Hillary Clinton, that tea, mm-hmm, you got one vote for me with that tea, because, you know, I love a tea, you know? Next thing is, t the title says, items each always has on hand. Now, I don't know if Miss Hillary Clinton is saying this answer, because, you know, she say she support the urban life, but if this is what she's doing just to get these votes, I don't know, but I'm sold. But anyway, the item that they always have on hand, Miss Hillary Clinton, gotta have that hot sauce in her bag, swag. So, you know, I support her on there, because you gotta have some hot sauce. You can't just... This chicken ain't got no flavor, you know? You gotta be able to suck your finger and have hot sauce on it, you okay? You can't just... What is this? No, no flavor. And they said Donald Trump has, has a fork. Now, I want to know why Donald Trump got forks. Like, what around with forks? Like, what are you doing with the forks? Like, we already know you're a little super cool cook in the head. So, why are you walking around with forks? Like, are you going to You going to stab somebody with a fork? Like, what are you doing with a fork? Because I'm scared for my life. Oh, my God. But it says he, use a, he don't like to use his hand. And that's a good thing and a bad thing because sometimes you got to use your hands. 
But he said he don't like to like hold pizza, so he cut his pizza and eat this pizza with the fork. I mean, fuck a fork, bitch. Oh. Uh. Fuck you, preach. But anyway, the next one is lunch run. Now, the lunch run, Miss Hillary Clinton is talking about Chipotle. Okay? And um, Miss Hillary, I'm sorry. I can't, I can't get with you on that. Can't get with you on Chipotle because Chipotle got too many outbreaks. They got salmonella. They got snails. They got all that shit. I can't do that. I can't, I can't do Hillary. Uh, Hillary, I can't. I cannot. I don't do Chipotle. Shout out to people who eat Chipotle who got sick and have died and all that shit. But I can't do Chipotle because I love my body too much. I don't know what y'all put in that stuff. I don't even eat Moe's. So how the hell am I going to eat Chipotle? Nah. But Donald Trump supports McDonald's. Hello! You knew what it was when you said it. Because, you know, shout out to McDonald's. Plug. Um, but, and, so, Donald Trump got one vote for me with that. So, so far, Miss Hillary Clinton got two. Donald got one. And the only reason he got this is because he said McDonald's. And he liked Big Macs and Fish Filets. And I like Big Macs and I like Fish Filets. Like, <laughs> no cheese on my fish, though. And no cheese on my um, Big Mac because... I'm lactose intolerant, and I don't want to be on the toilet and stuff like that. But anyway, one vote for Donald, two for Hillary. Now, sandwich picks. It says Clinton likes to visit Jimmy John's. And I've never been to Jimmy John's. I know. So, Hillary, I'm sorry. Um... And Donald Trump likes Subway. Shout out to Subway with them 350 sandwiches um, every week. Yeah, shout out to him. Because he got, yeah, he he knew. So, yes, I have to choose Subway. I'm sorry, because I don't, I've never been to Jimmy John's, so I don't know what they sub taste like. So, it's going to be Subway. <sighs> sorry. So, right now, two and two. And the fundraising fair. Okay. It says... In April, hosted they host April in April. George and, and somebody hosted an event with thirty three thousand four hundred per person. Hold on, event. Hold the hell on. Let me read this bit. Hosted an event for thirty three thousand four hundred dollars a person. Hold on. So you mean to tell me like the people that was there had to pay thirty three thousand dollars? Let me read that again, because that shit hosted a, a Hollywood event. Well, they in Hollywood, so people in Hollywood got them coins. I need to go to Hollywood. But, um, Hollywood event for 30000 per person. On the menu was, um, res mm, somebody beef in tenderloin with a chocolate chip cookie ice cream. I mean, chocolate chip ice cream sandwiches. Mm. Mm. That was Miss Hillary Clinton. Trump held a dinner for 50000 Ahead of the New York restaurant, we had risotto, roasted. Mm -mm. Oh, sirloin steak, though. Hold on now. Mm. Mm. I'm really not an ice cream person, but and I really don't eat cookies because my teeth be fucked up. But mm. 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 Donald Trump gonna have to get that one too. I'm sorry. Donald Trump got to get it. I'm sorry. Because he got that sirloin steak. And I love me a good old nice piece of steak. So, I take some steak over some ice cream any motherfucking day. And happy hour. Miss Clinton. Love her vodka martini. Ow! Sex on the beach. Cosmetology. All that. Is it cosmetology? I don't think it's... Cosmetology is people get your hair. Is that... Oh my god, it's kind of metallic that people get your hair. Oh my god, that's people that get their hair. Cosmetol- Cos- God damn it, what is it called? Cosmetology. Cosmetology. Complex magazine. Um, damn, what is it called? Cos- You know, y'all know what the hell I'm talking about. It's, it's start with a C. Cosmetology. I think that's what it's called. I don't know. It's pink. And it's got brown shit in I mean, not brown, purple. So, that drink. Okay. Tr Donald Trump, like, 
the hell is this? Tito Taylor's. I don't even know what that is. Oh, it's a vodka and wine. Oh, okay. I never heard of that. So, Hillary, you gonna get that vodka martini. Give me a cosmopolitan. Cosmopolitan. That drink. Give me one. All right, so, right now, Hillary and Trump are neck and neck. Three and three. And we got two more things to go before I decide who I'm voting for. For this 2016 election. Guilty pleasures. Oh. Both of them gonna say ice cream. Alright. Both of them gonna say ice cream. Okay. Hillary Clinton can't resist a scoop of Mercer's Daily's New York based company wine flavored ice cream. Mmm. I ain't never had no wine flavored ice cream. Mmm. 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 Donald Trump, the candidate, she, Trump also considers ice cream, cherry, vanilla, a favorite treat. All right, so with that, my decision, since I never had no wine, so Donald Trump gonna have to get it because I love me some good old vanilla ice cream, but it ain't got no cookies in it, do it? It's cherry, vanilla. I don't do cherries, so nobody's gonna get that. I don't do cherries, so I'm sorry, Donald, mm -mm, cause I don't do cherries. I don't do cherries, no. Nah. So, you know, mm -mm. and the weirdest food habits. Um, ever since hearing about the immunity boosting property, hot peppers, Clinton pops a few raw jalapenos every day. Mm. His long time and Donald Trump says like steak well done. It'll be rocking. Oh my god. Because I don't really like jalapenos. And the way that this thing looking three and three, if I choose this, it's going to be Donald Trump. Mm. But I love me a steak. Well done. My mama do too, so. Mm. Sorry. But Donald Trump, I got to get that steak well done. I don't, I can't, I can't eat them jalapenos like that. I can't. Uh-uh. Only time I get that is when I get it on my pizza. But I don't get jalapeno. I get banana peppers. So, that's the difference. But, I mean, if that's the case... You know what? So, it's going to be a tie. Because we can do them jalapeno peppers and y'all that on my pizza. So. Alright. Well, it's going to be a tie. It's a tie. Damn. I try not to make it a tie. I try to, like, be fair. And, like, to try to click, get Hillary Clinton. Like, but Hillary, like, you had to mess me up with that Chipotle. Why you couldn't say so, way? And why the fuck you couldn't say, like, McDonald's or something? Then I would've, like, got you. Like, it would've been all Hillary Clinton. Yeah, it would've been Hillary Clinton as 2016 president. But you did it to yourself. Yeah. I hope anybody is not offended by this because I'm just, I'm doing this as jokes, okay? I'm not voting for Trump if, if I had gun to my fucking head. I'm not voting for Trump. I would vote for a boo the fucking clown and suck my nuts or something in 2016. Anybody that was else in the categories, if that was the case. But no, nah, I'm not. Um, but you guys, make sure you go out and vote for real. Because your vote really does count. Even though they say, well, me, personally, I don't think it does. Because I didn't vote. So, where did my vote go? Because if I didn't vote, then... Who? 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 I just, I had a feeling in my head that, oh, Barack Obama was going to win. So, hey, it happened. Hello. So, I didn't have to vote. But anyway, you guys really do go out and vote. Like, I'm really being serious right now. Like, really go vote. Um, Make sure you are registered. Cause I think today is the last day to vote. So, make sure you go out and vote. Okay? Go vote. Right the fuck now. I think we can go register. Election day is the 8th. So, of November, I think. So, make sure you go out and vote. Okay? And, like I say all the time, make sure you go like, subscribe. And follow me on all my social media sites to be connected with me. And until next time, America. Stay black. Be you, bitch. It's your boy Z signing off. So you guys have a wonderful evening. 
Hey, yo, 2016 needs Hillary. 